Kicking it off here with these two superstars in this huge Elimination Chamber match. The luck of the draw is so important in a match like this, guys. If you're one of the last to exit your pod, your chances of winning this thing go up exponentially. Oh, what a slam. Now look at this aggression, just oh. pure brutality. Come on, easy. Better be careful not to get disqualified. The champion into the cover. And the shoulders up in time. Too soon. Look at this. Boom. Nice. golden opportunity slips so easily. And I can't help but wonder if he's now regretting his decision to compete inside this massive and unforgiving structure. Boy, the time just flies, doesn't it? Elbow drop! The Elimination Chamber structure underwent a total overhaul. The chamber now stood 24 feet in height and was comprised of 10 tons of steel. There was more chain link added to the structure as well. The chain link can rip a superstar's body apart in an instant. Ooh! the elimination chamber, the easiest way to put it is every square inch of chamber inflicts tremendous damage on the human body and psyche. The elimination chamber provides a type of brutality that takes years off a superstar's career or could end that career in the blink of an eye. And that's done with no apologies. The redesign of the elimination chamber structure was the subject of heavy speculation in the WWE locker room. I stood in the redesigned chamber and was overcome with this chilling feeling. The elimination chamber just annihilates a human being. You guys know what I like most about Brock Lesnar? It's that he lets his actions in the ring do the top you want. I wish a lot more people would employ that strategy. We're about to find out who enters next. What a stop! Good grief! Superstars love to talk the talk, as Corey was alluding to. But with Brock Lesnar, it's as if there's no time for talking. He just wants to get in there, get the job done, and leave. Just like his shirt says, eat, sleep, conquer, repeat. Destruction just comes naturally for the Beast Incarnate. Superstars who've come out of the pod like they were fired from a cannon. Oh, it's 
locked in. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Out of the look. There have been so many incredible moments from the battles that have been waged inside the Elimination Chamber. Corey, earlier you talked about when a superstar exits their pod and enters the Elimination Chamber match. One superstar's entry into the chamber that I'll always remember is Kurt Angle's at 2006's New Year's Revolution. Kurt Angle entered the chamber without any fear and without any hesitation. And the champ kicks out. Still too fresh. Body press. He's in control. strength is carrying your opponent around like this take. Let's put it this way, Cole. Who's it gonna be? He has something big planned. Lesnar looks to be finally feeling the effects of this attack. But he a great job escaping. Try to turn this thing around. I think it goes without saying, but Byron, the keeper, any Brock Lesnar opponent is to avoid a trip to Suplex City. Uh, yeah, that's an easier said than done, Michael. Big or small, Lesnar has set everybody he's been in the ring with to Suplex City. He's making a statement here for this attack. What a stop! Good grief! Here we go. He's fighting back here. I expected nothing less, Cole. When this guy's on, look out. Rotating vertical suplex. Nicely done. But I don't know how much gas he has left, guys. Here's the pin. Title on the line. Here comes the Undertaker with a flying clothesline.
Oh man, it's, he's got the shoulders down. Two, three, Huge elimination right there. Been eliminated. Oh, what impact! A bad place to be for the challenger. His hopes of winning this match appear to be dwindling in a hurry. I love it. He's taking a beating, but refusing to stay down. Sometimes when you're in a match like Elimination Chamber, that little extra adrenaline keeps you going. Harsh impact. Escapes trouble there. The Elimination Chamber is an environment that inspires human destruction. It breeds wreckage and carnage. Over the years, the pods that hold the superstars have even been used as a weapon. And they're supposed to be shatterproof. Check out when Mark Henry threw Randy Orton through the pod. I don't know how the Viper survived. Challenger looking absolutely exhausted in there. He put up a good fight, but it may be the end of the line for the challenger here tonight. He has got to do something quick. He's fading fast here, guys. If I'm his opponent, I'm thinking about putting him out of his misery. Oh, what a close line. Forcefully delivered. Wow, I'm just as surprised as you guys are. Oh, my goodness. Stone. Game, set, match, this one is over. He's going for the pin. Two, three. And this match is over. I know this six-man elimination chamber match is going to be the topic of conversation at many a dinner table tomorrow. These guys showed flashes in this match, but flashes don't exactly set the world on fire, as these highlights show very well. Overall, this match was average at best, but not every match is going to be memorable. In fact, I've almost forgotten it happened already. Here is your winner and new NXT Television Champion, The Undertaker. Ladies and gentlemen, that's a very big win here tonight. To get the pinfall victory over such a high-quality opponent is incredibly impressive, Michael. Go and adjust your TV, folks. This Vegas crowd really is this loud.